So you just finished shopping at the outlet mall because you heard there was a huge sale going on at Banana Republic. It's been a while since you picked up a pair of skinny jeans and the old ones you've been wearing don't fit anymore because apparently leg day is actually a thing again in your life. But all of a sudden shots ring off in a parking lot. And guess what? They're coming your way. You peek around the vehicle to see if you can get a view of who it might actually be, but it doesn't matter at this point because at the rate these shots are coming, apparently this guy must have been watching No Country for Old Men right before a psychotic rage and has Javier Bardo running through his veins like ice water. You try to fight fire with fire, but again, you're dealing with a guy who's made up his mind that he doesn't care if he goes home tonight, and you're hit. You're bleeding out a two-foot fountain at the side of your left bicep like the scene in Hostel where the doctor slices the woman's throat after hanging upside down for the past two hours. But good thing you brought along your trusty EDC bag. You run back to your vehicle to acquire the rest of the items that you hope will save you in active shooter events because nowadays it's more common to run into hostile environments with scheme ass individuals than getting spam comments on your Tumblr from Joanne wanting you to promote it to her waist trainer website. But at that very moment is when you realize what exactly in your vehicle could be the reason you go home to your loved ones, or worst case, get a one-way ticket with a tow on your tag that has an expiration date on it, which is what this video is about. The three budget items that can give you the advantage for whenever the guy in a Richard Nixon zoot suit comes up to your driver's side window asking for some spare change. Since I've been on this medical binge lately, this one's for the guys who consistently haggle at me in my DMs about why I don't do more medical breakdowns. Well, you got your wish. I believe medical supplies should play a major role, but more importantly, a simple system close to your person so that if the time ever does come, you'd have quick access to a car support to yourself or a loved one. And what better way than to invest your hard-earned $15 into a well-respected company that advocates saving lives? The Urban Medical Panel by Urban Medical Gear is an essential molly panel combined with elastic loop and equipped to hold med items. Its hook loop feature on the back of the panel presents itself as a real life threat to all your little $20 binge widgets that you normally fall for on Amazon. I mean, let's be real. Nothing beats the thought of buying a Swiss Army knife from Cambodia equipped with an app that can actually tie your shoes while playing all your monthly bills on time. Everything's all roses and daisies until you're trying to figure out why you're stuck in a return line at Kohl's, arguing with the lady about why you should've just kept the $20 and saved yourself the headache. The good news about the web adapter panel is that it's universal to your vehicle's loop areas. The bad news is, well, you could've just saved the extra $5 and spent that on ibuprofen instead. The crazy part about life is that sometimes we often forget that simple mechanics be spending a ridiculous amount of money when all we really need is a bug out bag with a backup mag and a couple smokes to keep you from being a victim to William Birkin's mutant abomination. If you've been high on EDC bags and get home packs, it wouldn't be a bad idea to keep one in your vehicle for quick getaway situations. Go ahead and say it. But Aaron, you talked about this topic on plenty of occasions. Please give me one more reason to fall for another one of your five minute loopholes since this budget approach is the only reason that's keeping me from watching the other guy who makes similar videos and also sounds just like you. Well, just like molly panels with elastic looping, the back can also become a diverse system. And since this video is on a budget topic, you can build your luggage to a bare minimum, giving you just enough to carry out your mission. Or you can go bonkers and run a Romanian underfoder with a 75 round drum to the mix and call it a day. Now I'm not telling you to go all Frank Castle and top off your commuter sling XL with an M16A3 fitted with an M203 grenade launcher. I'm telling you that it might be a good idea to correlate with the other items you have put away for your vehicle setup. For an example, building a separate molly system compatible for easy access to run several methods with the rest of the components sets up a recipe for success. One of the more budget-friendly alternatives for this system is to utilize Greyman Tactical's 26 by 13 inch RMP panel. Using it as a host makes every other object that much more dangerous on a battleground. Just imagine, a product about as thin as two manila folders, capable to hold a vanilla M4, an IFAC, three tourniquets, a couple AR mags, two shotgun cards, and a weight reduced 1993 Acura NSX, and only paying $75 for it? It doesn't take a guy with Steve Jobs' bank account to come to terms that if you had polymer molly panels throughout the real estate of your vehicle, you might be able to give that Cambodian Swiss Army knife a run for its money. Come to think of it, you wouldn't have to worry about waving your flash pass in a customer service line as well. But I get it. It would be hard to argue whether or not the molly panel system would greatly impact your 98 Volkswagen Golf because the size of the trunk is about as big as Karuchi Trans waistline. 
Well, if there is one thing we can take away from all three items in this video, is that the reward is far more greater than the risk due to not breaking the bank. This should also lay down a foundation to give you room to purchase other things that will sink off this mobile grid. I've actually done separate reviews of each of these items, so if you're new to this channel and would like a more in-depth breakdown, I'll have the links in the description. You can also find these items available in the description as well. As for now, I'm gonna wrap this video up. To watch more content like this in the future, click the subscribe button. To get instant updates for the latest PewPew Pew content, click the bell notification icon as well, and I'll see you guys in the next video. To all my day one subscribers, you can support the channel by going to shopthankthroughtactical.com and picking up a hashtag thankthroughtactical trucker hat, or perhaps even a logo dad hat. We're currently working on other ideas to brighten up the website, so stay tuned.